My name is Colleen O'Connor. We are at Ellis Creek Fish Camp, and uh, we are located on James Island, South Carolina. The original uh, restaurant that was here was uh, called The Boathouse. It was located over the marsh. Uh, that unfortunately burned, and so we decided uh, that we would utilize the structures that were here, expand the outside dining area, and make it more like a camp-like setting and a little bit more casual. Uh, we have a variety of seating at Ellis Creek. Uh, you can sit inside or you can sit outside. We've got uh, an area that overlooks the marsh as well, and then we also have covered booths. Uh, in case of inclement weather. You can sit there if it's raining um, and still get served. Uh, we do offer a variety of food on our menu um, from fried seafood uh, to a great burger, chicken sandwich. We have tacos, um, chicken and waffles. So it can really appeal to those that are, uh, that are seafood lovers and non-seafood lovers. We do have some vegetarian offers as well, Beyond Burgers, salads, I would say on the whole, the favorite dish here, myself included, is going to be the grouper sandwich. I like it blackened, however, you can get it grilled, fried, or blackened. Um, I find that Ellis Creek is unique. Um, there's very few restaurants that are on the water in the Charleston area. Um, and as well, we also have a, a wide variety on our menu for seafood lovers and non-seafood lovers. If South Carolina was a dish at Ellis Creek Fish Camp, it would be whole fried flounder, collard greens, and grits. You can find uh, flounder right here in the creek. Um, and there's nothing more South Carolina than local grown collard greens and local milled grits. Uh, we just always are conscious about the oak tree and making sure that we are always uh, build, we built everything around it so that we would not, it wouldn't be harmed in any way. In South Carolina, you can't, uh, you cannot remove any sort of live oaks. They are protected. It's kind of like the angel oak, the oaks at, at Middleton, they're all protected. We're dog friendly. Uh, dogs are more than welcome to sit outside anywhere. We also have a dog menu where we make homemade dog food. I have a turkey dinner for them that we sell here. And uh, it's, kind of, uh, it's kind of exactly like turkey Thanksgiving dinner for them. It's oats, uh, green beans, sweet potatoes, and uh, ground turkey. I think the community really uh, enjoys this restaurant because of the ambiance and the setting on the marsh, as well as our quick and friendly service. We do utilize the window service, which makes our food preparation time um, really quick. Uh, we have uh, servers here that have been here for a really long time and people know them and they like them and we just like everything to feel like uh, you're, you're sitting in your living room or your dining room. So we want everybody to feel as comfortable as they can um, and bring their dogs with them.